Hello, welcome to my channel. This is Sarah, and I am doing a coloring book review flip through for Romantic Country, the first one. Uh, Co-cut, The Land of Beautiful Towering Castles, a fantasy coloring book, and I think the artist's name is Eerie. Um, I apologize profusely if I've pronounced that wrong. So, the measurements for this coloring book are 10 by 10. 10 by 10. Nice square coloring book. Nice big coloring book. This is the front. This is the back. This is the spine. And this is the thickness. It's a pretty thick book. Inside, you'll see that there is a dust cover on the book. This is the actual cover. I like this because it gives you the opportunity to color another whole picture. And on the other side, that's the back of the book. Very cool. It's like it's a hidden little thing. So let me put this back on here real quick. Inside, it tells a little bit about the artist while they were a child and what exactly inspired them to create this fantasy world, how long it's been going on, etc., etc. Here, it tells about Coca. It tells the history, tells about the people, tells about the buildings, tells the importance of everything in the little uh, island and the other islands that are in Coca. So let me do the flip through, and then I'll talk a bit about the book. One thing you can probably see already is the spine of the book takes a bit of pressure to stay down. That's okay. There are chapters in this book. The artist does all of these drawings with toothpicks and ink. And I read somewhere on the internet that it took them 700 toothpicks to complete this book. That's why you'll notice that some of the lines are not as dark as other lines, like this section right here, and they're not as thick um, as other lines in the book. Um, the thickness of the lines varies quite a bit. Now, there are three in the series. I know right now the only one available is the first one in the U.S. The second one is coming out later this year here. And I know you can buy the second and third ones right now. They're quite expensive um, from other countries. You can get them off eBay. You can get them off um, Etsy. I've seen them on there. But I've seen them going for like $35, $30 a piece. Um, so if you just wait a little bit, you can get them much cheaper than that. This book is one of the most thoughtful books I've ever used for coloring. It has a backstory. You get to know the people in the town. Um, you get to know what they like, what they don't like, what the buildings are used for, the history of the town, and you kind of you kind of want to know more. You kind of want to to have that second and third book out right now because you want to know how the story is going which is one of the coolest things I've seen in a coloring book so far. Now 
the paper quality in this book um, is not artist quality paper, but it definitely is much thicker than uh, printer paper, copy paper, that kind of stuff. Um, you would be able to use water-based markers, coloring pencils, um, probably watercolor as well, gel pens, anything along those lines. If you're going to use the alcohol-based markers, I would really um, test it first before you decide to go go and do something like that. In the back of the book, it has each page, and it tells a bit more about the town under each little paragraph of everything. It has the chapters divided up back here. And one of the neat things about this is for um, anybody to enjoy. There is an attached poster in the back right here. And I don't know if I'm going to be able to get the whole thing on this video or not. But you, you can cut out these shapes. Cut out the town background here. Flip it up. And attach it to the bottom of this so that it stands up. All these trees will stand up here. And then you will have all of these items to stand up and play with um, around your little stand-up village of Kokot. I thought that was pretty cool. So that is the end of my review. Again, paper quality is great. Um, really nice paper quality in this book. One of the coolest backstories of a book I've ever seen in coloring books so far. So there it is. Um, again, this is Romantic Country, Cocot, the Land of Beautiful Towering Castles, a fantasy coloring book uh, by Erie. And happy coloring.